Hello everyone, my name is Olko Sarah and I am at Malta Blockchain Summit right now. Um, I'm to the, here with two extremely nice gentlemen who <laughs> should introduce themselves. Of course, this is Steve Good. <laughs> they from left the it to a woman to start. Of so course, you guys ladies right, first. This is Steve Good from the Coin Chat, as you should probably know. And if you don't, it's Steve Good from the Coin Chat. <laughs> and Yuri Katado also from the Coin Chat. Thank and you so we much are here at the Malta Blockchain Summit. This is awesome seeing you here again. Mm -hmm. Yes. Super yes. event. <laughs> What's been the highlight for you being here? Uh, probably the networking events. There are absolutely quality people over here. Um, I felt like the event in the summer still had some sort of a scammer uh, sort of a vibe. element. Yeah, the May event still had the scammer feeling. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Scammer feeling. What does that mean? So, uh, yeah, so people just kind of like, you know, I've got a great project and how much money can I raise for you, but you have to pay me money to do it. It's like, huh? <laughs> so, we have a hundred million dollar portfolio and we need yeah. to help you raise money. It's like, what? So that's, uh, what else? Yeah, bananas on blockchain. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wait, really? Bananas on the blockchain? We're, we're just... Yes, there was bananas on the blockchain <laughs> in May. That's true. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> Actually, oh, how much I remember they when raise? someone told me this. I was like, you must be joking. I was like, he's like, no, 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 it's seriously. No, they were tracking bananas before. on the blockchain. I yeah. remember that. I thought that was super crazy uh, again. I love that. I, I love haven't that. seen any banana projects this time. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> nice contrast because this time we've got aviation on the blockchain. Mm. Which was the rare block, which is really cool. Totally they won different. an award yesterday. They won the award last night as well, yeah. Yeah, and they were the lead sponsor. Yeah, and then you have um, Semantics that won an award. Semantics, no, Sem Salamantics. 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 Yeah, they beat out WireX for, oh, really? for their payments, yep, for, um, for an award. So that was cool. So it's good to see, and uh, again, their product is, you know, not as live as WireX, and they yeah. still won out for being a more prominent payment <laughs> provider of payments to, you know, <laughs> company. So I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah. So it's good to see there's more evolution taking place in the crypto space. That's what I like yeah. about this event. Yeah. Are there any events that you went, either you went to yesterday? I know you, both of you are busy, heavily networked. But have you made it to any events yesterday that you saw that you really enjoyed? Besides yeah. our talk, obviously. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, yesterday was absolutely crazy. From like three o'clock onwards, I just done an event after an event. So the first one was fun for, and it was a casino uh, actually, tournament. How many? How many? Um, how many uh, like attire changes did you do yesterday? Three. Yeah, because I, <laughs> I, I saw. I was like, "It's you, but this you're in black this time." And wait, weren't you wearing red before? <laughs> yes, and then I changed for the evening as well. I like to change my outfits and confuse people because if I like embarrass myself, then I look. Well, different. It, it, not only that, but they don't remember meeting you because so many people meet so many people. Yes, events, like, exactly. Oh, uh, who are you? I'm still Altcoin Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, the the black dress was meant to be the second and last outfit. But what happened? The first event I went to was the Fun for Casino tournament, and I won nine out of ten black black jack hats. So that was amazing. Wow! Uh, wow! And I was so excited about it and yeah. so jumpy that I ripped my dress. Oh no! So I had to get changed. Oh my god! Um, <laughs> <laughs> so we we missed the uh, the outfit malfunction then. Yes, yeah. it was quite funny. Actually. <laughs> I didn't care though. I want like two hundred dollars in their tokens and stuff, so I'm gonna go. Oh, that's so cool! Right. So you yeah, got two hundred dollars yeah. in shit coins? No, um, real coins. Casino uh, coins. Casino tokens. Fun for tokens. Oh, okay, but well, that's okay. Fun for still, you know. Yeah, yeah. Fun They're okay. still surviving. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> then there was like a U.S. Embassy organized event right. in the network. That was great. Okay. Then we went to oh, I don't remember now. And then we went to Tapas for a bit. Then we went to the uh, Beckwent one. And then we went to this um, really weird thing, 20 minutes away in a car, and it was like this vibe where they were like Satoshi. It was really weird, like in a club. Oh, Wait, yeah. you were there too? Uh, yeah, I've missed the spiritual. You missed thing. the satanic worship you part. Yeah, missed the whole like point of being there, which was to experience whatever that was. It well, was a spiritual awakening of the well. Yeah, like you oh, okay. Oh, okay. So we heard a rumor that Netflix was there, yes. hidden, recording this as what crypto people do, and it's so sad. Because it's not what we do in crypto. We're but, not weirdos, and we promise. <laughs> but we all got dragged into this stupid weird event by a multi-millionaire guy who thought this was a great idea, and <laughs> he's lost it. He's loopy, and I love him, but I don't love him. I don't <laughs> know what to say. This. No, no, this, this was a little bit too weird for our taste. But that's not <laughs> Netflix. Get it straight. That's not what we do in crypto. <laughs> no, absolutely. Not. Everybody ran really for the hills, got in the van, and left. There was, yeah, there was like yeah. half of us just in the back. Oh, there. that was such a weird event. Yeah. I got photographs though, some of them came out. It was yeah. all dark in this cave. Yeah, got dragged to a cave. Yeah. 
Well, we spent a lot of time with Electronium, actually, which was really a good oh, laugh. Cool. Yeah, Richard Ells and uh, Chris and um, Olivier. What a what a funny bunch of guys, <laughs> and they're so different too. It's a completely different backgrounds. Um, we just sat having beers with them, talking with them, and and because of their energy, okay. people were just coming and sitting. And Pierre Lynn came and sit with us. Oh, awesome. from Iota mm -hmm. from back in the day, awesome. and. Um, and there was somebody that came from a pharma project who seems to be doing really well. I can't remember the project name. Farmium, I think, something like that. Um, no, it was something else. But it was just a whole, just a mixture of people. Just we were sitting in the right place in the bar, and it was just good. People Work. were coming and going and coming and going. So, oh my God, is this ever going to come to an end? <laughs> Until the bar shut. <laughs> exactly, they kicked the, us out. The bar, like, the bar saved yeah. us. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> See, so what happened? So after this weird club yesterday, we went back to the big bond party. Yeah. And we're like, ironically, we're like, oh, let's just go back to ours, chill, and then go casino. Unfortunately, people thought that everyone's going to an after party. So everyone who was there came. 40 people came to my Airbnb and there was a huge party. It was fantastic. Yeah. But I got a little bit yeah, out of It was an entourage party. Yes. Nice. And we had alcohol Oops. there and anyway. Um, How did we miss that? It's because we went Because we were locked ritual. into the bar. We had the lock in in the bar. That's true. Also. Well, you hadn't dealt with electronics. So That's really true. Yeah. 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 Well, that and they, they locked us in and then they were giving us drinks after hours. So. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. When the bar does that, it's okay, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. Just keep it coming. So, so how have you been? It's been quite a while since yeah, it's been Yeah, it's been a few months. So, um, yeah, well, Yuri and I have been working on a book, of course, which is now done. And uh, just internal formatting, and then mm -hmm. we'll be out in hopefully a couple of weeks in May. Those yeah. are in May, in May. November. No. Yeah. Not May. Not, <laughs> Not May. May. Sometime in November, December of 2019. So, sometime early this year, late this Great year. Great Christmas gift then. Yeah, exactly. it's going to be stocking stuffers. Amazing! Yeah, that's our goal. Yeah. Where is it available? Where were you planning on? It's going to be on Amazon. Oh no! <laughs> you got it. Okay. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Amazon, Google Plus, Play, Amazon Play, uh, Google Play, uh, Apple iBooks. Mm -hmm. um, to start, and then we'll go from there. English version will be out first. Spanish will come second, and then um, we're working on a Chinese translation, and then of course, we'll see. If you can get a Polish translation, my mom she's a professional yeah. translator. Oh yeah? yeah? Oh perfect. So there you go. Line that up now. So perfect. So that's our <laughs> third one. Does she know anything about crypto? Um, not yet. Good, so she's gonna learn then. That's she the whole point of the book. Yeah. Yeah. Learn and translate. So, the can she read English? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's why she's a translator. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well she could have been a German Polish translator. I guess that's true. <laughs> that's true. We wanna make assumptions. <laughs> I'm not being known Hot. for the I'm not known <laughs> as being the smartest guy on the block, guys. Come on, you know. <laughs> what about you? What have you been working on? Oh, I've just I've just been doing the same thing as I do, you know, spreading the word of Twitter, saying what I think, updating people on the market, hopefully stopping people from getting scammed. Um, yeah. I've got some more. The tweets have stepped up a lot too. You've been really funny recently. What's going on with that? <laughs> <laughs> I got a new agent. That's why. Oh. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I wish I had an agent. Life would have been so much easier. Yeah, I wouldn't would be on my good. phone all the time. I'm no kidding. Yeah. Um, no, it's just that you know sometimes inspiration comes in, and I've been going to more events and socializing more, um, getting into the vibe of just joking around about crypto. And sometimes people don't understand the post or a joke. Uh, like XRP Army, they're not doing too well when you're harsh to them. Yeah. And there's actually theory around XRP Army right now that I'm either a transvestite or that I'm on steroids because my jaw's going square apparently. Uh, this is like some photo where they just show it like before and after. <laughs> like anybody, I don't know. What's anybody happening. can be photographed to look like something if you do Photoshop. I know. Yeah. I know. And it's just like crazy because I said. I said something really mean about XRP and I'm really sorry and I'm gonna come to straight forward with one of the XRP YouTubers um, what I exactly meant by saying like, the tweet that you have to have pretty low IQ to think XRP is standard. Um, <laughs> can we can we agree with you right now? Yes, you may. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Ripple people, but you know. Not sorry. <laughs> no, but not sorry. <laughs> not really sorry. Uh, so yeah, I need to come to terms and explain what happened. And because I've been talking so much about it and dealing so much with the XRP army, I actually had a dream last night that the XRP was $100, uh, $10, sorry. Um, From 30 cents to $10. Yes, and it was a Somebody nightmare. Somebody would be very rich. Oh, it wouldn't be us though. Imagine. No. <laughs> <laughs> if, if it went to like even to $10, that would make Ripple worth like billions of dollars, which would be yeah, totally uh, absurd. Yeah. What do they have? 99 billion tokens, so yeah, you make a trillion dollar company. Out At of this here. moment, it would yeah, it wouldn't would even make sense. No. That would just Nothing funny that much, honestly. No. 
<laughs> they're trying to aim to be like Apple, I guess, or something. Mm. Or Google. Well, good luck with that. Plan. Yeah. yeah. They have to, I agree. First, they have to unseat Swift in the banking space so we can talk. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> got some work to do, guys. Let's talk about something Look, legit, though, yeah. okay? Uh, <laughs> oh, come on. Ripple's legit. It's just the price is a bit ridiculous. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Slight differences of opinion, but anyways, okay. <laughs> I don't hate Ripple. I just no, I don't hate it. I, I just think the number of coins and the price is completely ridiculous. And yeah. people going, it's going to the moon, it's going to a dollar. It just doesn't make any sense. It's just financially doesn't make any sense in the valuation. I mean, I don't have anything against it. I mean, XRP is doing what it's meant to be doing. It allows you cross-border payments. Okay. And what annoys me is that yeah. we need to get this wrong. They, they're saying that it's going to replace Bitcoin. It's not meant to it's do, nothing to do what with Bitcoin, Bitcoin is doing. Oh, exactly. they're targeting the banking space to replace Swift. Exactly. Right. So that's the goal and people get confused with it and that's what really frustrates me. Yeah, yeah absolutely. It is doing what it's meant to be doing and if the community focused on it, then I wouldn't, you know, joke about For it sure. as much as I do. I know. We joke about it too. Although I have to say, Yuri and I talk about EOS a lot more. EOS? Yeah, we yeah. joke about that one more. Well, how EOS could raise four billion and fail. And yeah, deliver nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, I agree with you on that. I mean, that was a bit embarrassing. Yeah, um, that plus you just created a bunch of cartels of people who do all the voting for everybody else. So <laughs> it's a centralized <laughs> voting system. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> oh, well, it's I Steam or EOS. Pick, pick your pick on the cartel you like more. <laughs> This is the snark chat today. Wow, well, it's guys snarky, like, snarky. Boom. Well, you know what? We've been drinking and we got hangovers, yeah. so we got to say what we think. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes it's okay just to say what you think. I'm not a fan of EOS and no disrespect to Brock Pierce because he's a friend of mine. Oh. But, you know, that's the way it is. I'm not a big fan of EOS. Yeah. And I don't think you are either, Yuri. No. No. Every project has its goods and bads. No. And every, every team has things they do right and wrong. And it, the reality is everyone's doing the same thing. We're all here to add value and to make things happen. Ripple's doing what it's doing well. Steam set up a platform that allows people to publish content. EOS has set up an infrastructure that works. But there's things we can criticize about every project, including exactly. Funfair or anybody else, or even Electronium. There's something you or can find Bitcoin that you like or did like. It. Yeah. What? Who doesn't like Bitcoin? <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, I'm sure there was some probably somebody yeah. that yeah. So anyway, we're having fun here, people. It's not serious. <laughs> oh, it's half serious. <laughs> it's serious. Hang it over serious. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cool. Well, it's been a real pleasure having a chance to chat with you here. Yeah, I totally agree. Thank you for coming over and having sure. this chat. You know, just something normal and no shilling involved, which is quite nice. Just have a no, the only shill is check out Altcoin Sarah's channel. Altcoin Best Ladies YouTube channel and there you Altcoin go. Sarah on every social media platform. And the coin Twitter, chat. Instagram. Yeah. The and we'll put chat. all the links down below for everybody so you can check us all out. Yes. Together. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for checking in. Thank you very much. Have a good day, guys. Have a good one.